Spurgeon here with RevZilla TV to talk to you about the Force Field EXK Harness Flight Plus, available at RevZilla.com. So the EXK Harness Flight Plus is going to be standalone body protection for you riders out there looking for CE Level 2 protection. That's the biggest change that we're seeing with the EXK Harness is that this is going to give you CE Level 2 protection at the chest, shoulders, as well as back. For those of you that want to add elbow protection, there is going to be a connection where you can add elbow protection to this as well. But for those of you out there looking to just get into the dirt, have some nice sturdy armor underneath, this is going to be an option for you. Now starting with sizing on this, there's going to be three sizes available, small, medium, and large, and really you're going to be using a torso measurement for this. Tony on my left hand side, just to give you a general idea, is 5 foot 10, 195 pounds with a 42 inch chest. He is wearing a medium. So when you're sizing this out, measurements for the small are going to be sub 17 and 3 quarters inches for a torso measurement. We measured his torso around 19 inches, and that fell between the 18 and 19 and 3 quarters inch mark. And then if you're going for a large, if you measure your torso and you're above 20 inches, that's where you're going to want to size into the large. Now as far as colors are concerned, you've got the black and yellow, which is what Force Field is known for. Like I said earlier, this is going to be worn underneath existing gear, so colors aren't going to be that important for you. So Force Field is known for their role in impact protection. And with something like the EXK Harness Flight Plus, this is going to be for you riders out there that want localized body protection that stays with you. This is going to be for you off-road riders or dirt riders that will be wearing a jersey over top of this or some kind of abrasion-resistant layer. If you're going to plan on wearing this with a race suit, again, the shoulders are removable. You could use it as chest and back protection underneath a full-on race suit. However, this is big, bulky CE Level 2 stuff. You would have to size up at least one size in a race suit to be able to fit this comfortably underneath. So just keep that in mind when you're figuring out exactly how you want to use this. Force Field is going to use their Nitrex Evo armor in this, and you're going to see RPT, that's Repeat Performance Technology. You can hit this over and over and over again it's not going to wear down the protective nature of the armor. And it is a bit flexible, so this has a tendency to move with you. You do have Kevlar stitching along the sides, and the entire body of the harness is going to be padded with their older M15 armor, so you have padding throughout the entire piece on this. There's not going to be anything to impede the airflow, so you do get maximized airflow pushing through the armor. Again, if you're out there riding off-road, you're moving around a lot, there's a lot of sweat building up, you want the sweat to be able to be pulled away, and you also want the max amount of airflow to push through. The other thing you're going to notice on this, there's no buckles. So all of your adjustments are going to be done with Velcro harnesses on this. And I really love the fact that I can fine-tune exactly where the armor sits on Tony. Let me use his shoulder as an example. So if I take this, and Tony, I'm going to have you just go ahead and raise your hand up for me for a second. You notice Tony hits the gym. He's got some big arms here. Ladies, just take note of that if you're watching this video. You can fine tune this, you can make sure it's nice and secure without impeding, and that is a nice elasticated strap. So even as Tony's moving around in his motorcycle, he's flexing his arms back and forth, it works and it doesn't constrict his movement whatsoever. Also, up top, you're gonna have Velcro adjustments up top to both position where you want the chest and the back to sit, but also exactly where you want the shoulders to sit. So if I wanted to take this off, and I wanted to just kind of twist it back a little bit more to give me more coverage on the back, and then fine tune this again, I can get this to sit exactly where I want it to on Tony's shoulders. This is a big evolution forward from traditional armor, which is built into jackets, where you're kind of stuck and you can't really move it around. What Force Field has done, it allows me to exactly position where I want the armor for maximized protection, and by eliminating buckles, you have less bulk and less discomfort underneath the overall package. Really nice adjustments from Force Field with this. Tony, let me have you turn face backwards for me. As you're working your way down the back, you're going to notice full CE Level 2 back protection. You do have, even as you get to the bottom, just a little bit of Cossacks protection. And what we were talking about earlier, it does have that M15 armor built into the overall harness as well, so you have maximized padding and maximized protection throughout the entire piece. Now, when we're talking about the measurements earlier, when you're measuring your torso, you might have measure right where the shoulder meets the neck, and then you want to go right down to your waist. And like I said, Tony came in around 19 inches, and you can see exactly how that back protector fits on him. Spot on. Tony, I'm going to turn face forward for me. And the last thing I want to hit on, just go ahead and unzip that main zipper just to show exactly how we're doing this. 
It's a main zip entry in the front. You can see that padding has ventilation that works all the way through on the back, so you do get that airflow through. And it is that M15 padding behind the Nitrex Evo armor. And then you can go ahead and zip that up for me. And as he's zipping that up, I do want to show, when we're talking about the adjustments points earlier, just take a look here. You do have two main adjusters. So once you have that main Velcro strap secured in the front, you can then fine tune the kidney straps to make sure this sits nice and snug in place and it moves exactly how and where you want it to on your body. There's a lot of riders out there that are utilizing standalone body armor and there's a lot of riders that are utilizing force field. If you want to hear more about what they have to say, click the info button on your desktop or mobile device to hear more about what those riders are rocking from force field on their rides. If you have more questions for us, never hesitate, get us on the phone, give us a call, 877-792-9455, or simply type us out an email, cs at revzilla.com. Thank you for joining us for this look at the Forcefield EXK Harness Flight Plus. I'm Spurge. Enjoy the ride.